What's up, dogs? My homie Zams are here in two more days till Christmas break. I'm excited to be with the face of HGTV, Nelson. Pleasure's all mine. Let's get started. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Girls State is a leadership workshop where girls learn about governing. They'll work with other girls from around the state to create a mock government. I don't know what that means. Criteria must be a current junior must be interested in developing leadership skills and have an interest in government, politics, community service, and if you want to know more information about it, check the flyer and the chatter. Our special shout out today is Edwin Mejia. He's been following in the footsteps of Ivan Santos by becoming a DECA president of Frankfurt High School. He's our producer, but in reality, he sits and talk, walks and talks with Emily Flores because they own this building. And for some reason, Nelson, he's watching Mr. Beast over here. And for those of you who know a guy by the name of Holden, he was the one who got sick in the hallway and he sacrificed it to not take final exams. Now, let's send it to weather and sports. Morning dogs. Last night, the swim team faced the World Riding Tri West Bruins. Congratulations to Mia Hernandez for her first place in diving. Personal best are Alexis Snyder with the best in 200 freestyle. Isaiah Jimenez dropped to 1.5 seconds in the 200 freestyle. Anna Beersleep improved by 41 points in diving. Christian Shipley swam a personal best in the 100 butterfly. And Mia Hernandez dropped to 0.48 in the 100 backstroke. Moro Lopez dropped to 1.27 in the 50 freestyle. Good job, dogs. Swim team is back in action tomorrow night against Lebanon at home. Next up, wrestling. The wrestling team travels to Rossville tomorrow to compete in county. So make sure you go out there and support the dogs. Lastly, girls basketball. Frankfurt Lady Hot Dogs battled it out with the Tri Central Tuesday night after first quarter surge led by Payne Debris and Zoe Westerman. The offense went cold to the end of the first half. A strong defense effort in a 12-point second half by Jordan Frazier led to an exciting finish. Frazier led the Dogs in scoring with 12, and Zoe Westerman added 11 points in the defeat. JV Varsity is back in action Thursday night with the home contest against county rival Clinton Central. The Suncrest and Elementary Girls basketball team will be recognized at halftime of the Varsity game. Be sure to go out there and support your Lady Hot Dogs, but if you can't make it, the Hot Dog Night will be partnering up with ISC Network to broadcast the, the game live. That's all for weather. Now back to your most JV weatherman. Thank you, Avi. Today we had a windy morning for our first day of finals today. It will continue to be windy throughout the whole day. The winds were average around 20 miles per hour. It is also going to be pretty cloudy. But on the bright side, it's going to be pretty warm today. The high for today is going to be 60 degrees and the low is going to be 52 degrees. The high, the high winds are supposed to carry on to tomorrow morning and be accompanied with some rain. So be careful going to school tomorrow. I personally know some bad drivers, so, keep a, so you need to keep an eye out for them. You don't want to be a person that gets a broken leg on the day you have to take finals. Well, anyways, that's it for the weather. Now back to your host. What's up, dogs? Good luck on those finals tonight. Hope you guys ace them. Happy birthday goes out to Dakota Fisher, Addison Craig, Kimley Perkins, and a special birthday goes out to Kevin Ramos. Next up, for lunch today, we'll be having food. Hopefully, good food. Last but not least, if you're looking for some good Christmas presents, you're in luck. The Bookster has gotten some new items just in for Christmas. If you still need that unique gift or a great stocking stuffer, stop by and see what we have. Here are a few of the new items. Coffee insulated tumbler, $13. Stainless travel tumbler, $6. Hot dog beanie, $10. Blue slash black fleece blanket, $20. That's all for today, dogs. Don't talk about Spider-Man, and make sure you have a Willy Wonka Wednesday. Make sure to smash that like button and subscribe. Bye-bye, guys.